Hello everyone. I'm going to give you a quick explanation on how to use the gizmo, particularly for when you're graphing so you don't run into any trouble. So first you're going to want to make sure that you're set in bar chart and that you have clicked the box that says show numerical values. That way you can see the actual amounts of solute that you have added to your system. Then you're going to adjust the temperature slider to the desired temperature. I'm just going to set it to 20 and then you click OK. Make sure you have the correct um, solute selected. Then you just start adding your mass according to whatever the gizmo tells you. If the gizmo does not tell you how much mass to add, you can choose any quantity because we're trying to see what our saturation point is. So I'm just going to add by fives. And if you notice on the left, you can see your solute going in and on the right, you can see how much you added. And I'm going to continue adding solute until I start to see some of this lime green line appear. That lime green line is telling you how much solute is accumulating at the bottom of your container. And since when we are dissolving, it's just the amount that dissolves that we are interested in, the amount at the bottom is simply telling you that you have a saturated solution. And, and just to uh, illustrate this, I'm going to show you a little bit more. And you can see that same solute um, accumulating at the bottom of your beaker. Now, to determine how much solute actually dissolved in your system, you're going to want to subtract the value above the lime green bar, which in this case is 64.35, from the value shown above the aqua bar, in which case this is 95 grams. So to calculate how much actually dissolved, you would take 95 minus 64.35. If I were doing this lab for real, in your gizmo, and it was my assignment, I wouldn't have allowed this much to accumulate at the bottom before I did my math. I would stop as soon as I see some of that green bar up here. I hope this helps, and if you have any questions, feel free to ask.